And dancing's Derek Hough hits the insider panel. Next Insight. What's happening, Insider.comers? You know who this man is. It's Dance with the Stars sensation, Derek Huff. How you doing today, my brother? Good, man. How you doing? Good to see you. Good to have you here. Pleasure. All right, now, how's it going out there? It's down to four now, the semifinals. That's right, man. It's getting intense. I mean, you know, this is the time when, you know, it separates the, you know, the men from the boys, so it's, it's tough. I'm not going to lie. You got a perfect 30 on your 50s Pasa Doble, which seems to be the talk of the show right now. You guys, in fact, reprised it last Tuesday night. How did you come up with that? I know you guys were scratching your heads. Yeah, I don't know. When I first initially thought about it, I was like, I don't know how I'm going to be able to marry the two together because it's just so different. But, uh, you know, I think when you're, you know, a challenge comes to you, if you're able to rise to it, you know, it actually comes up to, you know, some, some exciting things. So. Now, second perfect 30 on the show. I haven't got the first one, I think, the week or two before. Yeah. Is Nicole settled down now? I know that she was going for perfection. She finally achieved it. You know what's so funny? What you see on the show is such a small part of what actually goes on back there. You know, we are having such a blast on the show. We are having such a great time. And you know, it does get emotional, a little bit stressful sometimes, but sometimes it's great to get that out because it allows you to move on. You know, it allows you to kind of get it out, out of your system, kind of start over and go hard for the semifinal and final, hopefully. <laughs> is Nicole the best dancer that you've been partnered with? Um, I definitely think that she's the best, you know, she has the best capacity and kind of the, the more experience, I would say. Um, but, uh, you know, I, I've actually loved all my partners, you know, equally in, in their own different ways. You know, they've all, you know, had some different experiences and different, um, you know, it's been, it's been great with each one. Now, how do they pick the partners? Because you, my friend, have been very lucky. Uh, <laughs> Joanna Krupa. Uh, yeah, yeah. Who, who else have you been yeah, partnering Yeah, Shannon Elizabeth, Burke Burke, I mean... I wait, 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 did you guys pick it out of a hat? I mean, you paying the producers off? How do you well, end up with the hottest women? I walked in on one of the producers in a very uncomfortable situation. <laughs> Basically, it was an unspoken thing. No, I'm just kidding. Yeah, you know uh, you know something. I was like, listen, you know I know something, and let's just carry on. No, I'm just kidding. Um, no, you know, I don't know. I think, uh, I don't know. I just, I, I count my blessings, I guess. All right, I need to ask you about our Miss Lisi Nash, Miss Jiggly Parts, before she hits the set here. You sure. got a secret crush on her? What, what's... Man, Nisi is like, she was like the core of our cast, absolutely, and, and still is. I mean, she, she's, you know, anybody had any problems, anything, they would always go to, to Nisi, and, and she's always, you know, so level-headed, and she just was always there for everybody. She's wonderful. I love her. Cool, man. All right, last question. What can we look forward to on Monday night from you, Nicole? Monday night, uh, we're doing the cha-cha and the Argentine tango, so it should be, uh, we'll see how it goes. I don't know yet, because I haven't finished the routines yet, but we'll see. <laughs> <laughs> right on, man. Well, firefighters will be standing by in case the dance floor is set ablaze. Derek, thanks for joining <laughs> us, man. My pleasure. You can check out Dance with the Stars on Monday nights, 247.comers. Check it out anytime on the insider.com. Matt Lauer's cheating headline scandal? Why the Today Show host is defending his marriage? I'm Chris Jacobs. It's with host Lara Spencer reporting from New York. Correspondent and attorney Chris Jacobs. Celebrity panelist, comedian Nisi Nash. And special guests, dancing's Derek Cotton and former Miss USA, Tara Connor. The Insider. The Insider. What side are you on? Now, from Hollywood, the insider is on. Matt Lauer's cheating headline scan. The dance video going viral on YouTube, nearly two million hits. Some of the girls' parents on the defense this morning on GMA. These kids are going to a dance competition and they're wearing dance clothes. They're going to be dancing and singing to songs that are popular on the radio and popular in, in pop culture right now. <laughs> As for the girls, they seem unaffected by the controversy. Usually we try to put 120% in and even more. All right, so you've seen the video. Is that dancing too racy? What side are you on? It is absolutely too racy. It's sexually suggestive. These girls are shaking stuff they haven't even used yet. I don't like it. <laughs> I actually have to say that the dancing, some of the dancing is actually pretty amazing, actually, with the pirouettes they're doing and actually the technicality of what they're doing is pretty phenomenal, but... The gyrating. The Let's talk about the gyrating. The gyrating, the gyrating go and miss, but that costume is absolutely way too easy. I think absolutely it's definitely they not They look like little women. Outfits could have been tamed down a little less gyrating. Yeah. The dancing was phenomenal. And could they have done the same routine if they absolutely. had pulled the tank top down? 
on a movie? Exactly. Right. What do I need to see your navel for, huh? I was in dance when I was younger, and we did have little crop top outfits. So part of me thinks it's not that bad, and that they look adorable. And I'm I'm also very impressed with the dancing. Tara, were you gyrating at eight? Were you <laughs> we, we were did you jiggling? Little, we were did you jiggling? Jiggle. Were you jiggling stuff that you hadn't even used yet? I'll at say eight. that their jiggling was far more advanced. I think you got your whole life to be powerful. That's you don't have right. to start at eight in a tube mm -hmm. top, lace up the front while you popping your booty back. I just yeah. trick uh, it. Larry, you've got a daughter around this age. Weigh in on this. Would you let Kate do something like this? Absolutely not. I'm with Nisi on this. Well, uh, hey, Jill, so I hear a Baldwin brother was being a smart aleck last night. Uh, but um, Bob, good one, Derek. Good one. For the sexy women of summer. Cameron Diaz, she's funny and goofy, which is... Right up your alley. Thanks, Miss USA. Back from New York City. And hey, Lara, back here in Hollywood, we've got Niecy Nash, dancing's Derek Huff, and former Miss USA, Tara Connor. Lara, yesterday we took size over the hottest blockbuster end of summer. Now, a present for you, Chris, and you too, Derek. <laughs> Thank you. It's time to debate the sexy lady. Oh. Oh my goodness. All right, I've got to go with Angelina Jolie. I knew you were going to say that. Of course, right? <laughs> Not only is she hot, she's going to heat things up this summer in that thriller Salt. Well, and get this Us Weekly on Stance Today reports that Angelina did all of her own stunts in the movie. So that is pretty cool. That's, That's, That's amazing. Cool. You got me? Chris, I'm going to go with um, Julia Roberts. I want to go someplace where I can marvel at something. Eat, Pray, Love looks phenomenal. She's a total natural beauty, a girl's girl. You know, I'm probably happy to go with Cameron Diaz. You know, she's not only beautiful, but she's hilarious. She's funny and goofy. You know, the movie uh, Night and Day coming yeah, out. Yeah, that looks great. Nisi, what do you got? because yeah. I know Derek and I love talking about the hot <laughs> women this summer. But up next, Tara Connor, the focus is going to be on you and about her weight after dancing. Plus, and your dance partner done got thick. <laughs> Welcome back to The Insider from New York City. Looking good in the Big Apple, Lara. And back here on the panel in Hollywood, our dancing's Derek Huff, former Miss USA Tara Connor, and of course the lovely Miss Niecy Nash. We're tracking your input on the controversial single ladies YouTube phenomenon. Is it too racy for these little girls? What side are you on? Vote on TheInsider.com. The tally's ahead, but first, Us Weekly's Jill Martin has more gossip on why two New York stars were in... ...dancing with the stars, but I need to know, have you, in fact, lost your jiggly parts? I'm guessing that you have. Is it oh, true? Oh, what? <laughs> Stop it! Knock it off already! You know I needed to hold on to all of it, so let's move on. Do you feel like you have held on all of it? Because I must say, you're looking very svelte, Nisi. You know what? The two men in my life, which would be Louis Van Amstel and my Mr. Wonderful, Jay Tucker, they both said, you lost weight. And I said, say it ain't so! Uh don't most of the contestants on Dancing with the Stars feel pressured to lose weight? Did you feel that pressure to be skinny or to lose weight while you were on the show? No, I never felt that. Um, and some of them may, right. I don't know, you know, but I have always been comfortable in my skin. Good. My grandmother used to tell me all the time, baby, when you're the only naked woman in the room, you look good. I love it. Oh, I love hey, it. This, is all, this is all you're gonna get. Hey, can I ask a quick question to Derek? Derek, everybody else believes it. Do you you believe that you guys will be taking home the mirror ball? Oh man, I um, I dread hearing that. Actually, you know, it's put so much pressure. But you know what? In the past, all the Olympians have won. You know, and no matter how, what, how the competition has gone in the past, in the final, if an Olympian is in there, they win. All right, we could talk about this all day and all night, but what is for sure is it is going to be a heck of a semifinal. And let's not forget about Aaron in 8-5. They still have a heck of a chance too. But right now, let's take a look at what we're working on for Monday's show. Inside the dancing semifinals, champion Donnie gives his picks. Who's going to go home next and who's going to win? Derek shows Nisi his new moves. And Nicole are safe, but somebody is going to get it. Thank you, Lara, and of course our thanks to Derek Huff. Good luck to you, Nicole, like you guys need it. And Tara Connor, of course, thank you for being here. You're going to be judging the Miss USA competition on NBC on Sunday, and she's going to be our special correspondent for that event. Thank you again no for problem. being here. That's it from us in Hollywood. Lara? All right, Chris, thank you.